Chromebooks have a reputation as affordable, easy to use laptops for families and schools, but many IT managers like their high security and ease of deployment. The new king of corporate Chromebooks is the HP Elite C1030 Chromebook Enterprise, which costs way too much for civilians, but has all the power and manageability a business could want. Even a business that needs to run Windows apps. Yeah, it does that. At $1,529 in our test configuration, the Elite C1030 is the most expensive Chromebook PC mag has ever tested. But it's also the fastest, with an Intel Core i7 processor, 16 gigs of memory, and a 256 gigabyte solid state drive, about four times the power of most Chromebooks. Not only is it a two-in-one convertible, but its 13 and a half inch screen has a three by two aspect ratio that's squarer and taller than the usual 16 by nine for a better view of productivity and web pages. It has three USB ports plus fingerprint reader security and its keyboard and sound are first class. The big difference maker here though is that HP also offers a subscription to the comparable Parallels desktop for Chrome Enterprise for $70 a year which lets you run Windows 10 in a virtual machine. Windows programs can't see the Chromebook's webcam and microphone, but they otherwise work remarkably well. You can cut and paste between the Chrome and Windows environments and share files and folders with the Microsoft desktop appearing either in a window or full screen, either online or off. Obviously, if you run dozens of Windows apps and rely on them most of the time, it makes much more sense to get a Windows laptop. But if you need just one or two in-house apps or specific features missing from the online or Android versions of Microsoft Office, Parallels Desktop is the real deal. And so is the HP Elite C1030. It costs a fortune compared to our favorite consumer Chromebooks. For example, the Acer Chromebook Spin 713 is a comparable convertible with a three by two aspect ratio screen for a whopping $900 less. But enterprise IT departments and occasional Windows users will love it.